Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, simple floral wedding title animation in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. Here you can see, I have already imported an image. The floral image downloaded from the internet, this image we will use later in this tutorial, this complete project is available for free, download link is given in the description, you can use this template for your better understanding. So now let's start our tutorial, with creating a new composition. Name it as wedding title. Make sure frame rate is set to 30 frames per second. Let's set the time duration to 4 seconds. Now select the rectangle tool. Now make sure fill effect is set to none. Now make sure stroke is set to solid color. Now, let's draw the rectangle shape. Perfect. Let's align the shape to the center. Now let's animate our shape layer. Let's add trim path to our created shape layer. Now in trim path, create a keyframe for end. Now let's change end value to 0%. Now at 1 second and 20 frames. Change end value to near about 91%. Now let's adjust the offset value. Depending on your rectangle shape layer, you need to adjust the offset value and end value. Perfect. Now in rectangle 1. In stroke 1. Change line cap to round cap. And line join to round join. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create a duplicate of shape layer 1. Let's position it at 10 frames. Now for shape layer 2. Let's adjust the scale value. Let's unlink the scale. Let's reduce the scale value of Y axis and X axis. Perfect. Now in stroke 1. Let's reduce the stroke value. Set it to near about 3. Perfect. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now select both shape layers. Pre-compose them. Name it as shape. Now for shape layer, press T to bring up the opacity. Now at 2 seconds. Create a keyframe for opacity. Now come back to start of the timeline. Change opacity value to 0. Let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's add our text. Here I am going to use Edwardian scripted font. Let's align the text to the center. Perfect. Now let's add our other text.
for this text, I will be using monotype Corsiva font. Perfect. Now let's update. Now let's animate the text. Now for text 1. Let's enable per character 3D. Now add tracking. Now for animator 1, add rotation property. Now add 2 seconds. Create a keyframe for wire rotation. Now come back to 1 second and 10 frames. Change rotation value to 90 degree. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Now for text layer 1. Press P to bring up the position. Now at 2 seconds and 10 frames. Create a keyframe for position. Now come back to 1 second and 10 frames. Now change the position value for the X axis, as shown. Perfect. Perfect. Make sure you have not selected any of the layers. Now select the rectangle tool. Draw shape layer covering our text 1. Now change fill to solid color. Now position the shape layer above the text 1. Now for text 1. Change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 1. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now for our second text. Press P to bring up the position. Now go at 2 seconds and 20 frames. Create a keyframe for position. Now come 10 frame backward. Now change position value for Y axis as shown. Perfect. Make sure you have not selected any of the layers. Now create a shape layer hiding the second text layer. Position it above the second text layer. Now for text layer 2, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 2. Let's change stroke to none. Now do the same for text layer 3. Press P to bring up the position. Now go at 2 seconds and 20 frames. Create a keyframe for position. Now come 10 frame backward. Now change position value for Y axis as shown. Perfect.
Make sure you have not selected any of the layers. Now for text layer 3, change track matte to alpha matte shape layer 3. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Select all the layers except shape composition. Pre-compose them. Name it as text. Here I am using the floral image downloaded from the internet. Now for floral, if you are good at using pen tool then you can create your own design. For this demonstration, I will auto trace the image file. Go to layer select auto trace. Make sure you have checked the apply to new layer. Now you can delete the floral image. Now let's rename the layer as shape 1. Now you can adjust the mask point to match the shape layer. Here you are free to do any modification to your design. Here I will create 8 duplicate of the floral shape. Each for different animation. Perfect. Now let's hide them for some time. Now make sure you have not selected any of the shape layers. Now select the pen tool. Now make sure the fill is set to none. Now you need to draw a mask covering the floral shape, as shown. Perfect. Now position the shape layer 1 above the shape 1. Now for shape 1, change track matte to luma matte shape layer 1. Here you can adjust the stroke width to match the shape layer. Now for shape layer 1. Add trim paths. Now check where our shape layer joins the floral shape. Now create a keyframe for the end. Change end value to 0. Now go 20 frames forward. Now change end value to 100. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's make our second shape visible. Now select the pen tool. Now you need to draw a mask covering the floral shape, as shown. Perfect. Now position the shape layer 2, above the shape 2. Now for shape 2, change track matte to luma matte shape layer 2. 
Now for shape layer 2, you can add trim paths and create the keyframe. Or select shape layer 1. Press U to view created keyframes. Copy the end keyframes. Now paste it on shape layer 2. This will save your time in creating keyframes. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now similarly we need to do this for more 6 shape layers. Here I will fast forward this, as it will take some time to create shape layers. A few moments later. Okay, here I have created shape layer for every floral shape. Creating this shape will be more confusing, so I have provided the complete template, you can refer to this project and create your own floral title. Now select all shape layers. Recompose them. Name it as shape. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our floral wedding title animation is complete. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.